Alright, so welcome to uh, another episode of how to build a uh, self-sufficient, efficient uh, stealth bunker. I'm the Line Engineer, and today we're making a, uh, we're going to do the portal room, except unlike placing a city in blocks, which is a boring and be easy to do. If you got diamond, if you don't got diamond, then it's extremely difficult to do. Uh, well, I have a diamond pickaxe, I actually should have gotten that, just in case I mess up. But um, yeah, today I'm going to show you the mold method for making portals. Now, I originally found out how to do this in uh, River vs. Blue, so yeah. Yeah, from Achievement Hunter. Actually, that was before I got the game, so yeah. Now, let's uh, go down and get to the bedrock. The reason why you want your portal to be on the bedrock is, uh, you know, to cut down the noise mainly. That's pretty much it. That's pretty much it, actually. Uh, and also the reason I'm putting it on bedrock is for the um, creepiness factor because bedrock fog helps a little bit. Helps a little bit in the creepiness factor. It's actually deeper than I thought. Well, actually deeper than I thought. There goes one pickaxe, so I only got. Yeah, we need to go back up to the surface to get that A to get A get that diamond pickaxe and um, yeah. So um, yeah, you can do this with just one bucket, but I brought six, and um, when we get back up there, I will uh, run you. I will um, you know. Sh I will show you an easy way to make it so we're on the bedrock level, as you can see, creepy bedrock fog spilling in. Actually, we're kind of under bedrock level, so. And now we're beyond it. Okay, so basically the same thing with my, knot, with my hand of knot that I have. Except a little bit more creepy. Actually, this is cool, right? Yeah, it's being too. Alright, so, um, a portal is, is uh, four wide, so let's make this six wide. One, two, three, four, five. Sneezed. Is this correct? One, two, three, four, five, six. Ah, let Oh, finally I get redstone. You know, it's been. I, I, uh, I've been on this board so long and I never got redstone for some reason. I got redstone, so I can make clocks finally. Um. This is it. Yeah, one, two, three. One, two. One, two. Okay, yeah. Uh, I guess I can make it seven more, so. Yeah, be right back when I uh, clear out this room. Uh, yeah, I'm going to go seven back and stuff like that, so. Timer and. Okay, and okay, as you can see, I did some mighty big changes. I I don't like this at all. Just put no door here. There we go. There we go. My, nice muffin, but uh, let's get rid of this and let's use the non-valuable pickaxe. Or it's valuable, it's just not as much valuable as um, diamond pickaxe that is. Okay, put that there. And um, since the portal is four high as well, being four low. Firstly, that was all of it. Pretty sure. Yeah, it was. Okay, so it needs to be four high. Um, since this is bedrock and the portal is going to be there, 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 uh, I can't dig into that, so I will have to go dig up. So, okay, that's the bottom layer. So, one, two, three, and then four. I need to move up two, I think. Yeah. Let's move up three just for space sake. So, uh, yeah, I'll go back to the entrance.
And be right back when I'm done. Oh, I see why I didn't. I know why I need that. All right, you go down. Let's run with this a little bit. So if I have a new door right there, let's put the door. All right, so I have to have the door right there, don't I? Okay, whatever. Get that out of my face. Okay, be right back when that entire ceiling's gone. Alright, as you can see, it is fully done. Now let's uh, put the outline of the portal. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two. Uh, you kind of get the idea. Wait, no, you don't. That's wrong. Yeah, that's wrong. The inside's supposed to be a three. Yeah, now you get the idea. I wish I had enough there for that. I should have enough there for that, but I guess I don't. So, um. Yeah, anyway, um. Let's go get that, uh. Oh, we don't like dirt, I swear. I didn't put that there, if that's what you're asking. Just random dirt. But, um. And let's go get the lava. And since you can stack buckets now, uh, you can't stack them with contents inside of them for obvious reasons, but uh, you can stack them empty. So yeah, this is uh, the best way I devised of holding lava is make a lattice. Um, it, you know, it's easy. You just click, 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 and click. You're good. So now let's go back down there. Oh yeah, and um, you're gonna need individual lava cubes for the f uh, when you uh, mold because um, if it was flowing, it would turn into a cobblestone, and you don't want to have that. You want to have lava. So bam, has to be all solid. Like so, it's all solid now. Uh, let me get some water, get rid of these torches, because the water's going to mess with them. And uh, when I get the water, it's going to turn into obsidian. And obsidian is what makes you use portals, whether or not you actually, um, you know, mind it or not. You're a little bat, okay. Get that water. Another bat. Yeah, just looking to see if we can explain on the I do, but I need um some iron, some uh iron because I don't have a um what you forgot, I don't have a flint still. Give me that. And there you see it's a Sibian. So that'll be our base. Now we gotta do in now um now for going up we have to do individuals. So what you do is, I guess the torches don't get splashed with water. So you can see what you're doing. Okay, um, then you make, obviously you make the same one block space.
Okay. And uh, I'll be back with lava and uh, what you call? I'll be back with lava and uh, SPN steel. Yeah. All right. As you can see here, get that, and I got me flint and steel. Well, put that on it. I mean the mistake. Yeah, but yeah. There we go. Uh, but let's go get some lava. And yeah, I'm going to do the same thing, uh, doing the cuts for the rest of the portal, because you pretty much get the method. Uh, but there's one more thing I need to show you. I am running out of time, actually. It's three, um, two, two minutes left, so I mean, as you can see, I don't got more, I don't got more lava. So, but, so, uh, to get more lava, you have to go to a lava pool. Which is why I recommend having multiple buckets. You can do this all with one bucket, if you must. You know, if you have only the free iron and, and you really, really want to get to the nether, or need to get to the nether. I mean, you can have an infinity spring, but you gotta go find lava. I mean, if you have a lava pool, you can always, you can always, always, you can always already be at the nether and get, you know, do that. Okay, and that's not buckets. Let's get out of here and go back to the um, thing. And dump these there. Actually, since I have um, the six buckets of lava, I don't really need to dump them there. Actually, I um. Actually, I would I will uh, dump them there and uh, I will dump them there and just get some more. So yeah, once I get there, after I dump them out, you know, go back and me some more lava. Okay, uh, I'm going to give you some more lava, and uh, I just wanted to show you how to use that level storage technique. Actually, wait, wait, I'm going to just do a little, you know, I'm going to come in and come out, and, you know, come out, come and come out with the, complaining about the, portal. Well, sorry, I can't, I just can't talk tonight, so, um, yeah, I'll be right back. Alright, let's do this. That there, I just, you know, I, I might as well show you me actually extinguishing them. Oh yeah, and when, um, be careful with the water. If you put it right on the lava, it will turn itself into a city and then you lose the water. Oh wait, actually, let's not be silly, let's do this. Build it right on each other. And then I have... Bam. And bam. I, I really wanted to save time, but who cares? It's it's like one of your 60 minutes. I mean, who can complain? Some people will complain. I, I know, but yeah, besides that. Okay, let's check on the progress. Uh, one, two, three. Okay, now I got it. Now I can cap it. Ow. Or not really. Oh, that's seven timer. Okay, we need four more lava, which is a good thing. I have already prepared that um, the lava storage. Having some, having a lot of buckets really helps. Like I said, you can you can do it all with one. Just need. Be very patient and use level storage effectively. Yeah. No, I mean, you could easily have a, uh, you can easily have 18 buckets of lava in your inventory. Because there's like 18 blocks here. One, two, three, four, five. Quite. It should be quite. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, 
8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Okay, there's 16. Although I'm probably wrong. I miscounted one, maybe, but, um. Yeah, who cares? Oh, before. Oh, not much, anyway. I mean, the reason why I cut out the corners is just to save, uh, time with, um, you know, to save, uh, oh, I forgot about this. I forgot about this weird issue that I have with this thing. You don't fit if you, uh, put the ceiling too low. So, bam, bam, wait, there's only three. Uh, uh, sacrifice the dirt. I'm sorry. It's for your own good, not really, actually. Okay, now let's water fight. And if I was correct, if I placed all the blocks correct, it'd be fine. And, and for those of you who are gangsters at heart, you can uh, chop out the corners if you wish. You can actually uh, exclude them from the molding process if you really want. Give me that. Like I almost did, actually. Actually, you know what? I, I got an idea for the next episode. How about do some me uh, your, uh, your first nether base? Sure, why not? There you go. It works perfectly. So there you go. That's, uh... The nether room for the CSV bunker also had to use the Minecraft molding system. I mean, the uh, nether portal molding system. Actually, how big is this room? The entrance, one, two, three. Uh, yeah, you can get the pretty much design from here. Next year, I guess, in, uh, next episode, uh, we'll be going to the nether and i show you how to survive the first five seconds of the nether without getting gastified. If I start on that cliff, or, uh, if, uh, if my portal spawned on the cliff, hopefully it did. It makes, things, it makes things a little bit more interesting. So, what am I doing? There we go. So thanks for um, watching and uh, like, like the video, dislike, dislike video. I'll see you searching through videos. And uh, if you have an idea for a room in the bunker, oh yeah, there's uh, another room that I forgot to do. Uh, I guess I could do that after we did another one. Yeah, but, uh, it's not, it doesn't involve potions or enchanting so on. Or using the thing that you uh, pin metal on that's, heat, that's heatified. It's called an anvil. Uh, but not that room either, but, um, yeah, oh, I messed it up, I, I accidentally made the mouse, so, um, yeah, um, I guess, see you in a second.